Well, 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 the time has come that everyone's been waiting for. Well, at least I've been waiting for because I've had a few videos about the Batman Squatch and I did a movie review on the movie Batman. So it's going to be a fourth video on Batman. I finally got my mail in today. Unfortunately, Dr. Squatch messed up on my order. They didn't send me the collector's box with the soap so i only got the soaps with no collector's box so got the box in the mail with all the soap with the riddler and the batman soap but we're gonna go over the batman soap let's gonna check out the batman this is gonna be the batman soap i officially have the batman soap in my hands everybody who's checking out my announcements on the dr squatch video that video has almost 1.3 thousand views already, so I was surprised on that. But we're going to go ahead and hop into this Batman soap review right after this. Alright guys, welcome back to Lil Mac JTV. Another review on some soap, but we have the limited edition, the Batman Brick. So we're gonna go over everything in the Batman Brick and see exactly what my thoughts are about the soap. First off, it's gonna have the maroon, reddish, black with Batman on the front instead of Squatch. This is the first official box that Dr. Squatch has made that didn't have the Squatch on it, the Sasquatch on it. So. This is the first one. It has Batman in the middle. It says, The Batman, Dr. Squatch. It is the Batman Brick Life of Man Medium Grit 5 ounce bar, limited edition. The Batman Brick. This bar features vigilant, mysterious, and enduring just like a Squatch man should be. Life of Man. It says, Meet me in the shadows. Deeds info. Meet in shower? Made from natural oils, there's no harsh chemicals, it's cold pressed, sustainably sourced, and the ingredients are as follows. You can check it out, you can pause it, and I'll go ahead and read them. It's saponified oils of olive, sustainable palm oil, coconut shea butter, natural fragrance, American spikenard, spikenard, life of man, powder, St. John's wort powder, Bamboo powder, black iron oxide, mica, kaolin clay, and sea salt. So those are going to be the ingredients. Now, let's go ahead and give this window a little smell. Uh... kind of hard to pinpoint it's supposed to have like a leather it says something about having a leather scent let's go ahead and open it up see what it looks like ah oh, there's a stronger scent so it's gonna be black with it's gonna have black swirls with gray I'm trying to pinpoint what this smells like I can kind of see what Gary 828 says he said it kind of reminds me of brick of the dead I can kind of smell it. it. Almost has like a cologne type smell. It's like almost like a ma it's a more masculine smell. I mean, I honestly like this one more than Brick of the Dead. I wasn't really a big fan of Brick of the Dead. Kind of hard to tell. I mean, I'm trying to, I'm trying to think of what I can what I can uh, compare it to. It doesn't it doesn't smell like the other squash soaps to me. It does have a hint of that Brick of Dead, but honestly, I didn't like the Brick of Dead, so I actually think this soap smells, it has a better masculine smell to it. Dr. Squatch throws these these like powders and different types of herbal powders in there that, you know, I don't know St. John's Wort, if it's supposed to be good for your skin, or if there's some benefits to St. John's Wort in a soap. I know St. John's Wort is used for other things. I know St. John's Wort can be taken orally. It can be used for uh, natural herb for ADD and stuff like that. I'm not sure exactly what it's used for in soap. 
Reminds me of a cologne. That's what it reminds me of. It has like an earthy smell to it. It kind of reminds me of like an earthy, it has like an earthy stint to it. It's not too strong. You know, they say there's a different experience in the shower than any other smell in the bar. Sometimes the scent strengthens when you shower with it. Sometimes it gets weaker. So I heard this one gets stronger. Experience in the shower is gonna be different. I don't have time to shower right now, uh, but depends on your preference. A lot of people prefer different type scents. You know, like I'm not a big fan of eucalyptus. A lot of people love eucalyptus. A lot of people like menthol in their soaps. I'm not a big fan of menthol. I'm not a big fan of eucalyptus. So, you know, it just depends on your preference. I mean, Dr. Squatch has a huge following. I'm sure there would be a lot of people that are gonna really like this soap. You got those biased people that regardless of what Dr. Squatch comes out with, they're gonna like it regardless. You know, I'm not biased with Dr. Squatch because I, tr I use so many different natural soaps that, you know, I like to venture out and try different natural soaps, not just Dr. Squatch. So they make good soap. They do make good soap. I'm not gonna down Dr. Squatch for that. If you guys have tried the Batman break, leave your comments down below and let me know what you think about it. Because it's definitely a different scent. It's something that you gotta have the nose for. But if you guys haven't tried Dr. Squatch and you're interested in trying this bar, this is a limited edition. So I'll leave that link down below and you can go check them out and you can save 20% on your subscription and you can add these to your subscription or you can get the collector's box. They aren't selling these individually unless you have, I think if you have a subscription, I don't know if they've changed it, but I know last time I checked, you cannot pick this up unless you have a subscription, then you can add it to your subscription bars. If you haven't tried it and you would like to, the link's down below. Anyways, guys, it's going to do it for the video. I appreciate everybody stopping by. Thank you for all the support. And uh, there may be a giveaway soon. See, I have plenty of bars. Dr. Squatch is sending me more bars because they messed up on my order. So I may be doing a giveaway at 400 subscribers. Might be an idea. I'm almost there. Just a little bit to go. So let's go ahead and get there. But anyways, guys, it's going to do it. Appreciate everybody stopping by. Thank you for checking out my review. And I'll be doing a real review shortly. So stand by for that check you guys out on the next one but until then peace out